Nine race program at Happy Valley on Wednesday night. Good program as well with the Hong Kong Golf Club uh, Challenge Cup. The feature race coming up is race number five on the program. We get it all covered uh, here. I'm Andrew Lejeune. Please say I'm joined in the studio by our former analyst in Paul Alley and race caller Mark McNamara as well. Mark, we've got a lot of first starters and a really strong finish to the program as well. We do indeed. Races uh, eight and nine, Andrew, are uh, very, very good fields. It's a race uh, night where there's not going to be too many short priced favourites and we're back on the A course as well, so some fresh ground and use for the first time. In a while. Certainly is. Jackpots, Paul, anything to look forward to? No, no jackpots. Um, we've got a nine race card as well, so all the exotics will be back one race with a nine race card, but uh, no jackpots to speak of. Okay, all right. Well, with the nine races, we start off with a small field uh, in the first class for the 2200 uh, metres. Jockeys not riding on the program. Uh, Luke Ferraris, Alexi Bedell, and Karis Teton as well, and Chad Schofield is still out also. Right, first event then. Small field for the 2200 metre uh, class four. Very competitive though, and Paul O'Sullivan, David Ferraris, trained five of the seven between them. So O'Sullivan with three champion pal heads the weights. Matthew Poon rides him. Unite Spirit, one of uh, David Ferraris' two runners, always trained by David Hayes. Victoria Seeker, another O'Sullivan runner. Lucky Diamond on a hat trick for Jimmy Ting. Kung Fu Master Panda, the third of O'Sullivan's runners. And then Go Ballistic, who's also a two time winner this season for David Ferraris. Joe Moreira ride him, Mark, from the inside gate. Lucky Diamond is going to lead from Ori Night Spirit up on the outside. Kung Fu Master Panda, Go Ballistic and Victoria Seeker with Champion Pal against the rail. Good to slow the tempo, but as we know in these 2200 metre races, things can change mid-race and change at a rate of knots. They can indeed. Uh, all right, well, with uh, O'Sullivan having uh, three runners uh, in the race, he's probably a good place uh, to start with Paul as well as he chatted with Mark at Trackwork. Paul, your two horses in race number one. You must love seeing these 2,200 metre races on the program. Yeah, particularly with seven horses in them. You've got three of them, but uh, still no guarantee of winning it. We'll talk about a couple of them. Victoria's Seeker, his last two runs have been excellent. Yeah, he's, he's racing in his, in his best form, and I think he saves his best for Happy Valley, but um, he's handicapped up to his best. You know, he hasn't won off this mark before, and uh, but as I say, he's racing very well. Is it the sort of horse that just goes the same speed all day, so a sit sprint race wouldn't suit him? Very much so. Extremely one pace. If you're in Hong Kong and you're one pace, the 2200 is your only option. Might we see a tactic if it is slow like that last time that he won take off down the back and make it a real staying test? Well, you know, certainly if the pace was, was off, you know, would it be uh, looking to do that? And so would the other six jockeys. What about Kung Fu Master Panda? How do you rate his chances? Yeah, well, he's, he's been, he was unlucky not to win his last start and certainly unlucky not to run a lot closer to the start before. So. He generally saves his best for, for um, Sha Tin, but his last two runs were at the Valley and they were excellent. So, um, again, he's in good form. Um, he's pretty, pretty nicely handicapped, so I'd expect him to uh, race well. We might as well go the third of the team, the one at the top of the book. How's he coming along, champion pal? Yeah, well, he, he made good improvement between his, um, you know, his last start and the start before. Um, but up over this sort of distance, that's the pedigree he's got and that's what he's looking to do. And he's a little bit unpa uh, one pace like the other two. All right, he's the bigger price of O'Sullivan's um, three. But interesting touching you uh, there, Mark, on the, the speed of the race as well. Wouldn't necessarily want to turn into a sit sprint. As we have a look at uh, Go Ballistic um, here as well, Paul, um, he's always in, in great form, winning uh, two of his last three starts, but they were in Class 5. Yeah, so he has to come up here to Class 4, but he comes in with a light weight and he has to carry a 116, so it's sort of five pounds less than anyone else. And the horse is in good form at the moment. Small field, don't think it's overly strong. I think he could run well once again. I just was worried about his class four record, which is the reason I left him out. And they did go silly in that race. Blake sat back and um, came into the race at the right time. Probably not going to happen in a small field like this. Yeah. He is the favourite at this stage, uh, Paul. And interestingly as well, it's Joe's first ride for the stable this season as well. Yeah, so he'll be on. So look, I'm going to go with him. I think he's, he can win again. His horse hasn't been in great form. He's won two already. It took him a while to get there, but I think he's just really come into his own here. Uh, this season. He's on top or should get a nice run in behind. Now Lucky Diamond he could just walk them earlier on and if he does do that uh, he's won his last couple and he can really sprint well as well over the 2200 and then Victoria Seeker he, he will want a bit of pace on. 7-3-5-4. Wasn't actually thinking of making Kung Fu Panda the on top selection until Paul O'Sullivan we spoke to him this morning and he was really bullish about the horse's chances up to the 2200 metres and we saw on the replay that he was unlucky last time so he goes on top Victoria Seeker will just keep running around Happy Valley all day. Lucky Diamonds won his last two. He goes to the 2200 for the first time and carries an extra eight pounds. And all's never too far from them. Couldn't leave him out in a field such as this. Six, four, five and three. 
I got the same forecast in actual fact. Kung Fu Master Panda and Victoria Seeker, the stable mates uh, there for Paul O'Sullivan, but uh, it is a very competitive race and they've all got, probably got some sort of chance in the open there. A class four over the 2200.